Uh, well, we're disappointed that we lost, obviously. Um, Wingate's a good team. They played well. They made they made shots today. I think that was really the difference. They made shots, and we didn't make enough shots, you know. Um, but they're a good team, and uh, but we're disappointed with the loss. You know, we feel like we could have played better. You're a team that's been watching this team for a while. You watch the players. You're seeing more. Does it matter the shots you couldn't call, or do you need to look to see where you are? No, I thought we got great looks, you know. I think um, I think our players got great looks where we want them to get them, and um, unfortunately, we didn't hit enough. You know, we were six for twenty-six. So, uh, no, I liked all the shots we took. Yeah, I mean, she's big. Um, you know, she didn't miss in the first half, but you know, she—I don't think she made one in the second half. Um, so, you know. I think the tough thing about them, I mean, if you look, they were really balanced. You know, it wasn't like one person that, that killed us. Um, you know, obviously, like, they like to score down low, but um, really their their guards really stepped up, played well today. Last thing, we talked about this a little bit. You know, the team is uh, the youth of this program. I mean, you and Coach are not afraid to change the team up, but it's uh, still a little bit of a lot when you see the team you guys have built. You know, what were the challenges of all that for, for Coach and Coach Hall? Um, well, honestly, with Corey on our team, you know, we're pretty used to going against a big body. So, I mean, I don't know. It was a little different. She plays a little different than Corey and stuff like that. But honestly, you know, I, w I don't want to say there's necessarily a challenge. It was just different, if that makes any sense. Coming from a big place for you guys, <laughs> you know, take away from team meetings real quick. First one is you guys have a double in the NCAA tournament. What does that mean for you in the next one coming up? I know, I know you're in a good seat, but you know, what does that mean for you to see that you have a stat line against Team Western? It means a lot, honestly. Um, I'm glad that I could go out there and you know, perform for my team and stuff like that. Um, I'm glad I could go out with a bang. <laughs> so, yeah, that's pretty much that. Coach, kind of plugged in for Corey and Coach Hall today and the last few years. What does it mean for you to get to see kind of the young Al Cross and SCB? You know, I know he started off D1 and then he went to some really tough teams the last few years. What does it mean for you? Well, I, I think even into that second quarter, we were close most of the way. Um, they had a little bit of a lead, and then they f they finished the quarter really strong. They hit a couple shots, I think a three, or at least one three, um, to kind of pull away there late, which was unfortunate for us. Um, third quarter wasn't great for us, and then you know fourth quarter we kept trying to make a run, you know, but um, it was a little bit um, well too little, too late, I guess. Um, you know, for us, I I, I think uh, the main thing. You know, we, we didn't make enough shots. You know, like I said, I, I thought we had good looks. If uh, if we shoot the ball a little bit better today, you know, I think it's probably a, a, a closer game and, um, you know, then anything could happen. But unfortunately, you know, it just didn't go that way for us. You know, one thing that surprised me about last night was the fact that you guys were able to get the ball out of the hands of Corey and Coach Hall and not just throw it to Corey. Is that something you guys have done in the past as well? Well, we've done that um, most of the year, um, you know, uh, from game to game, it may change just based on um, you know who we're playing. Or even tonight, we had to go away from it a little bit because uh, our point guard got in foul trouble. Um, she picked up her third there, I think, early in the second quarter. So um, that kind of you know messed up our, our five and five subbing a little bit. Um, but you know that's that's something we've been doing all year. Um, it's worked well for us. So. that one yeah well, that, uh, honestly uh, it's great you know since I've been here we've done nothing but improve you know every year we've always gotten a little bit further um, I love that you know this team I always remember that we made history and stuff I'm just I'm looking forward to like what the program you know will continue to do in the future but I mean it's a milestone honestly it is it's great <laughs> thank you <laughs> sure yeah I mean I'm really proud of this team um, with uh, with what they've done this year, and um, you know, last year we lost in our, our championship game to Limestone. They're they're obviously a great team, and um, you know, to be able to to do that this year and get the championship and get out here to to the national tournament, um, you know, it's it's exciting for them. And, and as a coach, I'm just really proud of them and happy for them, um, especially for the seniors to be able to go out this way. They they put in a lot of hard work to to help us get to this point. And then excited for our younger players to get to experience it. And, you know, hopefully it's something that, um, 
uh, that they really like and, and want to give back to, you know. Well, I mean, we've got some good players coming back. Um, uh, we signed four uh, four players in the early signing period, and um, we won't, you know, we're not done yet for for next year. So, um, you know, we feel like we got a good core coming back, some good players coming in, and we're gonna just try to keep keep it rolling.